Hello everyone, my name is Three, and you're watching Sonic Adventure Let's Play DX version. And yes, uh, I'm gonna take my normal voice now because I believe my voice is gonna be absolute terror for the rest of this episode if I continue like that. But yes, so welcome back everyone to yet another edition of Sonic Adventure Let's Play DX uh, thing. And yes, today we will finally conclude all the missions that I've ever missioned on the mission mode of mission. It was a long and painful ride, I can tell you that for sure, because especially at the end, big parts took me like a bajillion of hours to complete and I wish this would have never been a thing. Anyway, here we go, mission 6 clear for Amy. Uh, I'll, uh by the way, it's been a way too long since I have actually Play the game myself or actually watch the recording so I have no idea what's happening or which mission I'm doing. So, sorry for that matter. Um, there's a few things in Amy's, Gamma's and Big's mission mode that are a bit dickish, even more than I believe the last ones. The placements of the mission can be a bit wonky like this one with Amy where you just gotta do the ammo gel. It may just be because of the uh, really weird control uh, in in the game actually uh, but anyway in this mission with Amy what you gotta do is just jump here and I believe this one is the balloon is set on into the second uh, row of mirrors so you gotta be good with that then just go into prison get your next mission and like I, I, I repeat myself here but their controls with Amy I just in big is so wonky and I, I keep praising the actually I don't actually remember if I praise the physics that much of some adventure but like with Sonic and Tails, like the physics engine, I believe is fantastic. The weight of the character, how they move, their max speed, the acceleration, it's all very beautiful. But when it comes to Amy's and Big's, and even Gamma sometimes, it just becomes a bit archaic and glitchy. And let's die while we're at it, because that's how I complete most mission in this mode. Uh, I believe actually what we're watching right now is the last mission is Amy. Just making sure. It is! So, um... Yeah, Amy's missions are actually pretty simple. Just do what I do. This part is actually isn't randomized, so you can take the door I'm taking right now to access the billboard here. Easy peasy mission. Let's move on to E102. Okay, thank God I said it correctly. I thought I was gonna say the wrong number. It was like E122 or something like this. Mission 7, Lonely Metal Sonic needs a friend. How can we help him? However, can we do that? Actually, is there another mission here? Okay, I just sit around. I don't know why I didn't cut this out. I'm very sorry, everyone. I'm just wasting your time here for no particular reason. That's how my editing is! I'm always this kind of person, like, really, really f fucking dumb. Because I, gotta be honest, I am dumb. Like, a lot. I have a very low EQ. Uh... Anyway, here he is, here is our friend. It's a bit finicky to get him, to catch him, excuse me, to take him to his Metal Sonic friend. I don't know why your submissions are super fucking hard. And then there's this one who is just like easy peasy, no probably. I feel weird saying this. <laughs> Here's mission 21, protect the Sonic doll. So if you go into the stage of final egg, at the very end you will find a fuckload of spinners. And from there you just need to blast them all away. Yeah, again, easy, easy as fuck mission. I just don't understand how so some missions require so much exploration out of you, and others just like, yeah, fuck it. Here you go. Uh, this like here describes pretty good exploration. It's like you just gotta hit the stage here, not the stage, but the uh, the original. Switch so we can access this, so we can go to Emerald Coast with the little switch at the side of the hut. From there, just fly away to the medallions. Then again, here's another example of a mission that is really easy. <sighs> I'm really sorry for my commentary, guys. I don't mean to be negative or anything, but I've been playing this game for so long now that I can literally nitpick everything that exists in this game. And it's just like... Fuck it, man. I've been playing this game for like... 30 or so hours by now, and I'm 
so bored with things that aren't Sonic or Tails related that I just feel it's it's draining my energy for absolutely no reason. And just like this part alone, just just the last I believe three minutes of this uh, of this part is just so long. God. It took me like the last three minutes easily took me maybe seven hours to complete just because I first off I inconsistency in recording and signaling because Big's a bitch. <laughs> Big is a fucking bitch to deal with. I'm sorry for my language here, but I just don't give a crap anymore. Uh, this mission pretty, pretty simple. In the beginning, of the shelter just really clear the entirety of bedrooms from the enemies. Uh, next mission on the top of the temple can be a bit finicky to get to again because I believe of the wonky controls. Gone up into windy valleys, and I believe this is also the last mission as a Gamma, if I believe correctly. I might be entirely wrong, I'm usually wrong, so wouldn't impress me. Here we go. Here, th this part can be a bit finicky, you really need to take your time. And once you think you've locked onto enough uh, spinners, then you can drop down. This is another reason why this could be difficult, and if you fail, you need to, re uh, you need to redo uh, the, the, the first part of the stage since there's no easy access checkpoint, so it can be a bit finicky with this one as Gamma. Big, 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 fuck you, big. I'm gonna say it like this, this episode has been in the work for like three weeks now. I'm so tired of seeing your fucking face. Like, Jesus Christ. I hate you, big. And just look at this, this is why I mean my wonky control and wonky physics. Especially with Amy with in big. This is stuff like this. And I'm like, no, fuck this shit. Um, here we got a part with the uh, with the fish. There's like four fish you need to catch like this. Like this mission, if you remember, you was saying, uh, I'm the keeper of this hotel. Like you need to fish a fish, basically. And this one is pretty easy. I mean, 500 grams, pretty fucking easy. But like you get progressively bigger fish. And, I, and let me tell you, when you get like 2,000 gram. This shit becomes uh, monotony, becomes absolute sh I hate you, big. I really hate you. Like, I want a remaster version of Sonic Adventure DX, but with no big, no Amy, and probably a better controlled Knuckles and Gamma, if that's possible. I mean, I'm fine with the rest, I just find the rest to be absolute boredom so yeah I don't I just, I just really don't care uh, hey we are in a mission in the jungle this one can be a bit long and because you're walking with big you'll find it slow and annoying and not really interesting when you need to find three flags I don't believe they're randomized actually none of the mission are actually randomized so this is why I believe none of them are there are three very set in particular flags, you can just go from the ladder and head left uh, on the left path from there. You should find all three flags pretty easily. They're all at pretty, uh, pretty, pretty visible l uh, landmarks. I don't know if I could say that, but it's the best way I can describe it. Uh, mission 60, something is hidden in, the, in inside the dinosaur's mouth. In mission 44, I'm the keeper of this ship. Now, th those missions are done in order because of. Again, a uh, recording sessions that I did, and it's kind of fucked up. I also need to get this uh, lower power up. I don't think I've shown it this far, so this is why I'm including it here. From there, I can get the goldfish, and uh, this is where you get the, the fish from the kennel. It's basically in the. the how's, how's it called again? I forgot how this place is called again. Station Square! Yes, there it is. And here we go, get the 100 gram fish. Mission 35, I'm the keeper of the icy lake, which you would found in uh, big, you know, just right before the mission uh, of I speak. Here you go in mission 60, just break the ice, I believe, on top where you find the ice cube. You should have no problem with this. Here we are with the fishy fish of the icy lake just before the, 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 the uh, ice peak level. I don't know, I just feel like saying ice peak. I, I don't care how this level is called. So 140, and there we go. I believe one of the latest mission. Uh, yes, it is the last mission. Big fishing the 200 gram fish inside of Eggman's pool. There you go. 
There you have it, everyone. Every single mission clear and done. We are done with this shit, and I am proud to say that I am glad of this. So thank you guys everyone for watching, this was a very bad structure sentence like usual and uh, we're, we still have a part, we still have a part to go and this one will take just as long as the time to be released depending on my sesh, recording session. That's a thing that happens man, like I can't, I can't make this shit, but yes um I'll see you next time for some more, I believe we got like two more bonus missions video, so yeah, it's really some shit that is going on. Next time we're gonna be looking at the Chow Garden, I believe a bit of the trials, how it works and everything, I'm just not sure anymore. You'll see it next part, it'll be uploaded very, very recently. So yes, uh, thank you guys, everyone. thank you everyone for watching, yes, my name is Zonovigamithi, and I'll see you all next time.